Hello, my name is Jonathan Hales, and I will be giving a quick introduction to the Security Profiler tool, which is available in Microsoft Dynamics AX 2009. Because of the detailed nature of the security keys in Dynamics AX 2009, the Security Profiler has been developed to assist in identifying which security keys are required for specific user permissions based on the required processes and actions of that user. If you've had experience in the past setting up security groups and the security keys against those groups, you probably will have um, experienced a difficulty in knowing which security keys to set up against that security group. Um, this uh, new tool will help you to identify them quickly um, just by accessing the forms um, that the user would need to use. So to access the security profiler, first you're going to do is you're going to go to administrations. Under common forms, you'll find the security profiler. From here, to take that security profiler, you just need to start it, and then you'll just go ahead and uh, perform the specific task um, that uh, the user may need to perform or to to perform his or her duties. So, um, in this case, I'm going to go ahead and do uh, some sort of inventory employee. We're going to have this employee needs to be able to create new items so we'll go ahead and create a new item um, you need to remember as you're doing this that uh, you want it to be able to act any any forms or tables that you need to access um, to create the item you're going to need to be able to act you're going to be able to touch upon all those forms so um, we will go ahead and just keep, pick a couple here. Um, so, for instance, so for instance, you want your user to be able to uh, access the bombs. You're going to need to be able to go ahead and do that, create a new bomb for this item. Um, if you want them to be able to access the on-hand form, we'll go ahead and access the on-hand form, which there is not on-hand because I just created it. Um, transactions as well. If you want them to be able to access that, we'll access the transaction forms. And any other forms, um, set up button, uh, the sizes, I want to create a new size. Go ahead and do that. Um, so we can set that up. Also, you're going to need to take it in consideration all the journals uh, this uh, user may need to have access to. So if they need access to the um, transfer journals, so go ahead and create a new transfer journal form. Access to the lines table as well. Go ahead and create and go ahead and post that. Um, also, you need to take into account any reports that the user may need access to. After you've gone through and selected all the actions and forms that the user may need to access to, and you just go back to your security profiler, stop the security profiler, and from there you want to print the report. This profile ID you have set here will will uh, uh, will be the actual will actually represent the profile. ID for the specific profile you've, you've done. So, in, for instance, this will be one. Next time you run it, there'll be a profile ID of two, and so forth. So you can actually uh, select in the criteria just the profile that you want to see for the report. And you go ahead and print the report, and it'll show you all the security keys 
needed and I'll show you how that relates to the security setup so we'll go to user groups here and create a new one and check on the permissions and then you're going to see here our security profile report right here and how that relates specifically to these so it's telling us we need to go to basic tables under basic Yeah, we're going to have we're going to need access to the inventory dimensions inventory dimensions give them the access required then you can set that according to the user's access uh, needs so whether they have um, create access edit access or full access of course once you've gone through the report and set all your things um, then you're done that's uh, how you set uh, that's how useful the security profiler is in, in identifying which uh, security keys are required